Welcome to Excel Magic Trick number 340. Hey, if you want to download this workbook and follow along, click on my YouTube channel, then click on my college website link, and you can download the workbook. Excel Magic Trick 339 to 341. Hey, in this trick right here, we want to do a little grading. We have some scores here, and here's the max. But our goal is to subtract the two lowest, calculate the percent, and multiply it by a weight. So there's three things we have to do. Uh, take out the two lowest, calculate the percentage, and multiply by the weight. All right, so I'm going to start here. We'll do it the long way, for, or we'll do it in a, with a method that uses real estate, and then we'll see how to do it all in one cell. Uh, I'm going to add up. Alt equals is the keyboard shortcut to add, and then tab. So 52 is the total score for this student. Now, sum the two lowest. Well, we're going to use equals sum. And then we're going to use the small function. The min function will find the uh, minimum, the lowest, but small can find the first, second, third, fourth, fifth, uh, smallest, etc. So we want to take this whole range. And the trick is this k right here, we could put a 1, and that would give us the min, or a 2, and that would give us the second smallest. Ah, but when, when we want more than just one value, the small and the large function can handle it. That k right there can handle this uh, curly bracket, 1, comma 2, and curly bracket. That tells the small function to get the first and second smallest. Close parentheses and then close parentheses for the sum. So the small will deliver the two smallest values to the sum function, which will then add them. I'm going to hit tab. This doesn't require control shift enter. Now I'm going to subtract those two. And finally, we will calculate our uh, percentage times the weight. There is our percent. We have the part divided by on top of the total amount, and then times our weight. We don't need any parentheses here, because the, the order of operations will happen left to right. So times that 5%, and then there it is. Now, how do we do it all in one cell? Uh, there's a, at least a few different ways to do this. How about this? Instead of subtracting out the two lowest, how about just taking the four biggest? So I'm going to say equals sum, and then the large. And I'll take that same array. And now, the k, instead of just um, 1 and a 2, we can do comma, curly bracket 1, comma 2, comma 3, 4, and curly bracket. And that'll, that large now will get the four largest. And then we could uh, close parentheses, and then that sum will add them. Uh, let's just put Enter, and you can see that that, in fact, does what we want. F2, and then we want to divide it by. And I'm just going to. So I don't have to have total cells or anything. Copy that. Whoops. Copied, and then I need to d divide. Now, I'm doing the same thing, but on the same range. That won't work, so I want to change this 4 to a 3, and this 4 right here to a 3. And now we have our green range looking up there. Now, finally, all we need to do is multiply multiply by our weight. And that right there will calculate it all in one cell. Let's see still a different way to do this. OK, let's see if I can come down here. Let's do this formula right here. Now, instead of using the uh, large, we'll use the small sum and the small together to calculate this 37. So equals open parentheses and then SUM. And we want to do the sum of all of them. close parentheses, and then minus the sum of the small. So we want to, in essence, simulate what we did in two cells, but all in one uh, formula. So we'll take the small of all that, comma, and then curly brackets 1, comma, 2, in curly bracket, close parentheses, close parentheses. And I'm going to close parentheses again, just to show you that this will give you the uh, 37. All right, and now we need to divide by it. Now, let's think about this. If you, all the quiz scores are the same. You have whatever the quiz is in some cell. You can simply, in parentheses, say uh, 10 times 4, for example. Or if you had it in a cell, you could click right there. I was counting how many quizzes there are. But let's say we, it, it was set. You know, we're hard coding things in over here, too. So it's uh, probably just uh, all right to put that 4 just like that. And then finally, we need to uh, do our weight, so times and then the weight. So that's another option for one cell calculating 
subtracting the two lowest, calculating percentage, and getting the weight. All right, uh, that was some fun with small and large in this kind of array syntax. All right, we'll see you next trick.